back in Nam, they used to call me Bazooka. Because I used a bazooka. It is episode 54 of the Daily Vlog, and I am in my car on the way to the gym. Today was a little different in that my wife took our son to preschool. Usually I do that, and that means my morning is... Well, my normal morning routine is a little different today. So, <clears throat> I've been a little stressed because... Not because it's necessarily deadlines, but part of navigating... Uh, I'll switch that, got a little dark here in the shadows. Um, part of navigating just the business and the art aspect of freelancing you know this year I've this year I've tried to do more promotion and you start thinking because I, I've I've been on GI Joe for like four years so now and there's a little bit of stability in that but thinking like okay if I lost that would I you know how, how hard would I have to scramble for work and that's part of the reason why I'm doing the YouTube stuff now why I'm being more consistent with social media is that I need to uh, as a from a business standpoint build up that kind of base of uh, I guess just awareness of what I do so uh, which would you know eventually bring in more work so with that, you start doing that and realizing that it takes a lot of time to do that. It takes a lot of time to draw comics. And I've got so many commissions uh, that I'm, I'm just slowly getting through. And it's taken me so long to get through everything. And then there's the web comic, which is kind of part of you know, building up your own uh, you know, property. So hopefully in the future you can do something with that. It just seems like there's a hundred thousand little things that take time and so I was just kind of feeling it last night a little stressed not exactly sure uh, one of the things that I need to be well I, I've been actually pretty pretty consistent with I need to figure out more is redeeming the little bits of time for things like I right now I'm on the way to the gym um, I usually go to jiu-jitsu on Wednesday mornings and I will work tonight, so, um, you know, if I, if I just quit going to the gym and quit doing social things, and I actually don't do that many social things, but yeah, you could, you could burn yourself out, so the, the, that's the other thing, is you know, you can just work more and more and more, but how do I do it without burning out? Um, so, part of it is I'm doing a vlog in the car right now, uh, that's a little... You know, there's little bits of time when I would just be sitting here. Um, in the mornings, I'll usually fill up Buffer for my social media updates, just the basic, like, you know, if any of the images, and I think I've said this before, but I'll do that in between, you know, when I drop my son off and I grab a cup of coffee, there's like 30 minutes in there that's just when, when I have to be somewhere else in between places is a good time to do that. So I'm still... I need to be better about organizing my day so the time that I have is being spent well and prioritizing so but you know I guess it uh, you know this feels a bit a bit like a ramble but I don't know it's like juggling a lot of things so having someone to help like Chris do eBay stuff that that helps um, I wish I could, <laughs> I wish I had somebody to do all the promotion for me as well, uh, so that I just had to make the stuff and then let somebody else promote it, but apart from shelling out a lot of money for somebody to do that that I can't afford, no, it's just the way it is. So, I'm going to be consistent with this still and just keep doing it, it's just trying to find that sweet spot. Um, this afternoon I need to I, I've got to start the next issue of GI Joe and I've got to do some commissions I know that there's several of you that are waiting on commissions and I haven't forgotten they're all piled up 
I've started a lot of them. They're just sitting on my shelf screaming at me to get done. So, I'm gonna go work out, come back, and hop on it. The other thing, too, is the house stuff. You know, I've, I've talked about where you might be moving, buying a house, and uh, we've been kind of this limbo for the last five, four or five months where the house was, the house we're thinking about buying was being renovated. It may have been done in February, but then that got pushed to March, and they were saying, might be finished in March. Well, then that moved into April. And then now I hear that, the, well, through the grapevine, the house is done, but I haven't heard anything from the person I'm to sell the house. Uh, it's been a few weeks. So, in the meantime, we, we've painted our house, we've done all this stuff, we've got a few boxes sitting around, but when you, nothing is definite, and I haven't actually seen the remodel of the house yet. It's not like I'm going to sell my house. So anyway, it's been like this low-level background noise stress and sense of impending displacement and uh, it's just been kind of eating away I think a little bit here and there so that's kind of the state of the affair state of, that's kind of the state of affairs at the moment at the Shearer house till next time like subscribe share all that good stuff I will see you tomorrow